How do seals avoid sharks? Here in San Diego, we have a healthy population of great white sharks, and the seals avoid the sharks by hauling out. They use waves and tide changes to help lift them out of the water and onto the rocks. Hauling out can be a very tiring process for a seal. Once they get onto the rocks, they normally just sit there and rest, but they have to be quick before another wave comes and pulls them back into the ocean. You might be wondering if these sharp rocks can hurt the seal. Harbor seals have a really thick fur coat and a big layer of blubber that helps protect them as they glump up the rocks. Watch how this seal navigates their way out of the water. They have to time it perfectly so a wave can gently pick them up and set them down onto the rocks. Sometimes it takes a few tries. Harbor seals will also thrust with their hind flippers to help give them the extra boost they need to get out. These seals need to haul out every single day so they can rest and digest, get enough sleep, maintain their fur coats, and thermoregulate. Harbor seals are primarily active at night, so daytime is kind of like their bedtime. They're safe from the sharks on the rocks, but they're not safe from waves. As the tide rises, the waves will slowly crash up on the rocks and pull the seals into the water. Watch how this seal was trying to sleep, but a wave came up and pulled, I mean I should say rolled, then back into the water. If the seals aren't able to haul out and they have to sleep underwater, they use these water beds. Water beds are two rocks that seals will squeeze between so they don't float away while they're resting. Harbor seals have a really cool pattern on their coat that helps them blend in with the bottom and hide from sharks. And I just wanted to say, thanks for loving these seals and wanting to protect them. Thanks for watching my videos, and I'll see you on the next one.